Hey guys, it's Cass, and welcome back to Holocraft, where we immediately upgrade all of our armor to the delicious netherite. Ooh, cover me in debris. <laughs> The real disappointing part here was my game crashed, which caused me to lose all of the ancient debris hunting replay mod footage that I got, um, but you can kind of see it from the perspective of both Red and Jaldi at their videos, and they are linked in the description. Also, I told Red I feel like I was Magneto with the netherite helmet. My god, you are Magneto! I want one! Dang, you did all your armor, huh? And our next stop is flying over to Jaldi's, where we have some business meetings. We have some pretty important things to discuss. Uh, yeah, epic flight to her place. And then we sit by her cute little campfire and we talk some pretty serious stuff. We also do some flying around, scoping out two different locations for future builds and concepts, collaborations that I cannot wait for you to see. And I really want to my share hand? this super silly, <laughs> silly moment. It's a wither rose, just for you. Hey. <laughs> Welcome. Welcome. <laughs> Thanks, B. <laughs> <laughs> That's how I look for what? Hey, don't judge us, you guys. <laughs> Hmm? <laughs> uh, <laughs> that's not very nice. I want that rose back. <laughs> and then I'm back on that grind. I'm flying out to get some more ancient debris cinnamon rolls. Not only to upgrade most of my tools, but then, but then it comes to me to start another shop, which you'll see here in just a second. And let's just say we might have, you know, some serious dedication. It's our shop saying. It's our slogan. Okay. <laughs> you want it? Yeah. So hey guys, it's Cass. We're back to being shaderless because at this point of filming, end of the 
last almost week or so, um, our server upgraded to 1.18.2 and, you know, when a new upgrade or update happens, um, all the fun goody stuff, um, like Optifine and Optifabric, Replay Mod, all those goody gumdrops are not available yet until they update. But right now I'm working on a few things. As you see, uh, this is our storage area, but sh still not completed yet. Neither is this room back here behind me. Um, you know, we've been trying to work on stuff from time to time. I've been pretty busy and excuse, excuse, excuse. But, I've been pretty busy um, working on some Mario and Alice and everything else, so it's been a little hard, but let me grab what I have so far of the glass. Honestly, I need to be having this in my hand because I need to be getting the XP. I don't know why I crouched there. For this, um, but I'm making a bunch of sand. Oh, I don't know if I showed. I kind of want a little ham with all of the moss here, but currently the reason I'm making some glass is because I want to put a layer up over here, probably honestly above the mountains right below the clouds, because I want to stop it from snowing right here. Um, I just tore down a house that was right here, um, and if you could tell, I am trying to get rid of all these blocks of snow everywhere because, as I've been saying, <laughs> I'm gonna build my house here and I haven't done it, and right above my head you could see where I still haven't built the, um, Skelly, uh, um, 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 Skelly Barn, Skelly Ribcage Barn, but the server on top of everything not being updated yet was down for about four days uh, with some issues we were trying to take care of, so I haven't had much time to try to catch up. But behind me where I had exclaimed my house is going to be, I'm going to try to uh, kind of have a business proposition for some of my fellow Holocraft people, um, and, and, and we will see if a lot of them would be up for building a little tiny, 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 almost like villager type house right here, because see those two over there, I've left them. And I think I'm going to flatten and kind of terraform after I've removed quite a bit of the snow and dirt behind me. Um, and then I think I am really going to want to um, ask them and, and pay them, of course, of course, pay them with some diamonds to make their own version of a villager house here. And I think legitimately I'm just going to pick my favorite one, which sounds kind of rude because I'm sure they're all going to be great whoever does it, um, but maybe pick a different one to sleep in each night and just not fill in the vibe, no matter kind of the thought process that I'm having of trying to build a house. I'm just not vibing with it right now. I think I just have too many ideas in my head and I'm not committing and as you guys know, I'm pretty focused kind of on taking care of just the vibe of this space more than anything else. Um, over here, our other plan right in this area is to make a kind of bigger garden. So that's going to be something else I'm going to be focused on. But apart from the um, skelly rib cage, which will be right here, I do want to clear all of this out to try to get everything to look a little bit nicer, so I think I'm probably going to pop down right here below the clouds, spread some glass out. Hopefully it could stop snowing here, because I'm just like, I think, you know, as time has gone on, I'm really just not vibing 
with the spot of the snow. It's just not my fave. So, long story short, I'm going to ask some of the hollow peeps and pay them to build me their best version of a little villager house. So I'll probably come around, you know, and just mark out, you know, something along the, I don't know how wide, how big, kind of something maybe along the lines of this size. So then they can kind of all lay a few of these spots around and tell everybody um, if they would like um, and I'll pay them to build me a villager house and then that will kind of get the villager set up going in a different way and then I might whoops I might um, maybe learn how to fly with my elytra Then I know that we built out this whole spot over here which I've actually freed quite a few of them back here um, because I wanted them to keep breeding with some of the other oh we have a cat I don't think I have fish but even though I built all of this I think all of these ones back here that I'm continuing to breed and give more jobs um, I think I am going to <laughs> make it hard on myself, but probably transfer them back up there. And I know that we said I was working on <laughs> my storage space still. Oh yeah, rock hard. I know, um, kind of working on that, and these guys definitely need a home. I just have a little, sometimes too many thoughts about some of this stuff. You guys, let the cat through. We are gonna be friends. You are the cutest little thing with... Hey! Oh, wait, 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 wait. I want you to come with me, though. Come on. Come on, kitty, out here. Oh. I want you to sit in here. Um, but... Let me just show you guys how... I'm kind of getting up there and it's, you know, been a little bit of a process of trying to figure all of this out and starting to build the bridge as well. Um, but this is all water behind there and I want to put a bunch of coral reef kind of stuff. So I need to go back and hit that up. Um, and then obviously make this little spot a little nicer, but that way I could kind of get up here where, like I said, still have a lot I'm working on, still have a lot we're trying to um, work with, but I think overall that is going to be what I'm going to do. So I'm going to end up writing um, like a group post about it tonight and taking, after I lay out the wood, after I lay out all the wood, I'm going to take like an aerial screenshot of the area and kind of post it in our Discord and, you know, try to bribe everybody with some diamonds and see if they would like to expand. I'm probably going to chop those two down, but I'll leave their kind of like frame. Um, and I think we have eight, eight people. So that could be eight options. I'll end up tearing this house above my head down as well and just try to spread out little plots. So hopefully that's something that I'll be able to show you guys in the next episode. And I promise, promise next episode, I am going to dedicate basically the entire episode, which means I've got quite a bit of work to do. Um, and then now hopefully that 1.18.2 updates will be out we can get back to the shaders we can get back to the replay and that was the only thing that kind of held me off on um, finishing up this so this skelly ribcage barn will be coming in the next episode but <laughs> thank you guys for watching if you're here thanks for hanging out with all the crew from holocraft as always make sure that you're checking out the links to everybody I always link them in the descriptions. A lot of them have some pretty epic stuff they've been working on. A few of the peeps haven't posted videos in a while, um, you know, and life happens and bigger build plans have been kind of happening. 
um, and school and life and all that kind of gets in the way and I totally understand but thank you guys for watching and and I promise triple triple promise a semi house plan for behind me is coming together and then our skelly skelly sitch over here so I can move everybody around and finally get the vibe that I'm really trying to go for and maybe trim all of this back more, kind of figure everything out more, and then go from there. But like I said, thank you guys for watching and the next time you're here, hopefully I'll have some other houses to show you and I'll start it out here and then we will be jumping into the Skelly Rib Cage. So thanks for watching for the 50th time, appreciate y'all so much. And I will see you guys in the next Holocraft.